What's going on guys, DJ F here, and today we're going to learn how to make a custom template for FL Studio. So I'm going to go ahead and open up FL Studio. And from here, I am going to pull up a VST that I want to customize and put into this template. Uh, you can, you know, select your favorite drums and stuff like that that you like to use. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and duplicate this. You know, perhaps you might, uh, whatever your favorite VST that you like to use in every one of your beats or whatever, uh, you can you could use that. I'm just using Doom 2 as an example. So, you know, perhaps maybe I, I like a Pacific snare. Yep, I said Pacific. And, you know, or 808 of, of certain type here. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in there and then uh, put a kick in there. Put uh, a snare in there. I'm just doing everything at random. And from here, I'm going to I'm going to save it. So here's the deal. Here, uh, make sure that you're in your projects folder. And once you go in your projects folder, you're going to go into a folder called templates. From templates. You're going to go and just name it something. I'm going to name it Dune. All right. So it says save to Dune. And from here, I'm just going to close FL Studio because it won't show up until like I open up FL Studio again. Now, I am going to go to new templates. I'm going to select Dune. And there you go. That's that's basically it. So you know, I'm gonna close FL Studio one more time so y'all can show I can show you guys, you know, because you know how FL Studio will open up a, a certain template, and as you can see, it opened up uh, all those Dune twos and and the drums that I selected. So that's basically about it, guys. That is how you do it. It's not really hard at all. Uh, shout out to DJ Idea for the idea for this tutorial. Uh, I hope this helps him especially and everybody else. So you already know what time it is. Stamp time, gang. Stamp time anytime. Crab Tendo. <laughs>